Hello everybody, my name is Robo and welcome back to another build tutorial. Today we are actually going to build another modern house, but it has a little different concept to it. So it may look weird comp uh, compared to the other builds I did, but it may suit your taste. Um, I'm not really too sure, this is more of an experiment. So let's just try and build this. Um, but this build will use less material than the other one and also it's a lot easier to build less complicated and um, I guess that's good I'm not really too sure modern builds I like it when it's complicated it looks nice like that but I'm not too sure about this one but anyways uh, we are actually going to use some block of quartz and quartz slabs because they are awesome in um, modern builds and we are using spruce again and oak later on and also we're using a lot of gray wool um, since 1.6 came out uh, we can actually just use stained clay, which looks a lot nicer and texture-wise. But, you know, we are in 1.5 because I like shaders. So, yeah. Anyways, first of all, as I said before, this build is a little more experimental, so it may not suit your taste. But, hopefully, it will give you some inspiration on different designs. Um, but, anyways, first of all, we are going to build a solid wall out of quartz. 9 by 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, a little miscalculation there, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then we are just going to fill this entire wall up, solid quartz, man, if this was in real life, this house would have been already worth a million dollars, except we're in Minecraft, so it's all free, well, for me, since I'm in creative, alright, so once we fill this uh, wall up which we are almost done there we go once we fill up this wall we are going to start on the entrance so we're going to get some spruce make a little window area right here like this and then we are going to make a not really too sure what you call that hmm I guess a little I guess a little wall that kind of blocks the door from going outside I'm not really too sure but anyways this is the entrance it does look really I don't know derpy I guess but as I said before this is experimental um, this kind of looks modern so I kind of liked it so that's why I'm doing this anyways this is the second uh, floor of the building and we are going to make it look like this and then we are going to put some gray wool or gray uh, stained clay uh, depending on what I guess Minecraft version you're playing on right now but if you have shaders and you want to you know keep on using shaders you kinda have to use wool which is kinda sad but you have to anyways until you know shaders actually gets updated hopefully it does uh, let's see now we are going to do this there we go There we go. So that's going to be part of the uh, window for the gray area. This entire thing is going to be a huge, uh, I guess, two rooms, but there's different colors uh, to make it, I guess, more modern-ish. I'm not really too sure what you call that. But anyways, this side is going to be solid as well. Uh, it can be, you know, kind of solid where there's, you know, some windows, but I kind of like this design because uh, the I guess the concept I wanted to go for was uh, a more of a city approach. So these houses will be uh, placed next to each other. Um, so there's basically no room for windows. Well, you can put windows. You just you're gonna look into another wall. So there's no point. But anyways, yeah, that's the reason why. Uh, but now we are going to work on the back, which is really simple because, as I said before, I'm going on a more of a city approach to this build uh, there's going to be less windows on the back and the sides the front will have a lot and basically the design is going to be all on the front because the front is where most people will be looking at the sides will be just attached to other buildings so there is no need to make it look nice or I guess if you want to yeah you could but not in this case alright so the back as I said before is really simple as you can see it is really simple Two, two, I guess two colors, just like that, split kind of in half, and the front will look like this. Actually, not really, because we have to use the uh, 
quartz slab and actually just do this to make a little roof kind of thing. Um, you could extend this little one block out uh, to make a little roof shield, shielding, which I'm not shielding, I don't know, uh, which kind of looks nice, but I like this for this build because, as I said before, it's a city concept. There is no room for outer things, maybe in the front, maybe like that, but not in, uh, not in the sides because other buildings will be attached. So that kind of looks nice. I like that. All right, we'll go with that. Now we are going to do the roof, which is really simple. But before we do that, I want to do this because this kind of gives a little accenting in the house. And I love that. So there we go. I wish I had more, I guess, more variety of blocks for other colors because I wanted half slab roofs. I mean, not roofs, half slab wool, derp. I don't know, I like that, that color, that color scheme. Scheme, scheme, I don't know. All right, there we go. And then we are going to do the same thing here with the same material, which is spruce wood for this side. Oop. And then we will fill this up with quartz slab. I don't know why, but quartz slabs, or just quartz in general, for modern builds, they look fantastic, but I don't know. Other builds, not too much. There we go. And there we go. All right. So basically, we are done. We just need to fill up the uh, little areas here, areas up here, excuse me, with windows. Or wind, no, glass panes. Derp. All right, so which isn't, it's, this isn't really too hard. Oh, uh, actually, maybe it is. As I say, it's not too hard. I just screw up. Great. There we go. As I said before, this is really easy because we only have to do this side only. The side and the back have no windows. Uh, this could be filled in. I mean, it's kind of more of an optional thing because it doesn't really look too nice. Look, as you can see, I'd rather just have that because, you know, there's not too much room for anything to go in. So it doesn't really matter anyways. All right, now we will fill up the floor with regular old boring oak wood floor or oak wood planks because uh, I like that. I don't know why, I like the color. And also we will make a second story because we have to. All right, there we go, almost done. There we go, and now we will build the uh, second story. Uh, first of all, we have to make another floor like this, and then like this, and then I think the floor will go up from here and go up. So we can fill this up quite a bit like this, and then we will get the uh, Oak wood stairs right here, and then let's see. We will place it here. All right, all right there we go. I still need a new mouse. It's my mouse is still derpy. All right, now one, two, one, two. Since this house is a little small, we might have to go on a different approach with uh, rooms because we can't just have regular wood dividers, or any mater any block dividers in general, just because it uses too much room. So we have to go on a different approach with this. Uh, like the, I think, the last video, uh, or maybe maybe last video, I'm not really too sure, but we use sugar canes uh, to make little dividers, and in this build, it is really useful. And, uh, hmm, where are them torches at? All right, there's the torch. There we go. We'll just place some random torches around the room, like so, and also on top, like so. There we go. And also, I love this. Look at that. It looks nice. It, maybe if it was right around here. There we go. Looks a little more natural. And um, this could be a big room. Maybe like a little bedroom, I guess. And the bottom will be, I guess, a kitchen or a living room. And uh, you could put some uh, sugar canes here to make little nice dividers here. Put some accentings. You can also put uh, some, uh, you know, I guess, leaves or vines to give some this house a little more uh, spice, I don't know. Um, but anyways, this is uh, a, a new concept as I said before, so it may not look as nice as my other builds, 
but I wanted to try this out to see how you guys would like uh, this kind of building. It's more of a city, as I said before, a city approach than a, you know, regular build, I guess. I'm not really too sure. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys did, be sure to subscribe and rate this video because it really does help me out a lot. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys later in perfect timing. Look at that sunset. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. And I will see you guys later.